Hey guys, it's Zach. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a huge makeup haul. If you like this video, then please just give it a thumbs up. I make two videos every week, so definitely subscribe if you're not. And if you're not following me on Instagram, it is zboner underscore. It's written right here on the bottom of the screen. So the first bag I have here is all of the stuff that I purchased with my money. So the first thing that I see in the bag are both of the Urban Decay palette. I only used the neutrals one, which is this one, I think. Got this little Wet n Wild bronzer. It's 740. So right now I have, I'm actually wearing it right now. I have on the soft beige, which is 365. But then I got 369, which is a little bit darker. And then 363, which is a little bit lighter, just in case like my skin changes. So I got both of those, which is awesome. Um, and then I got two more of these L'Oreal Infallible foundations. I got another 103 because that's the one I've really been using now and I got 102 just in case I want to use it in the winter when I'm a little bit lighter. So I just got two more of those and then also I got um, the Pro Glow which everyone likes and I've kind of been into like more glowy foundation um, just on certain days. So I got this one in 204 and then I never have tried this one. It is the Infallible Total Cover and I got this in 303 so I just tried to guess and then I also got this wet n wild concealer corrector thing in the shade light ivory because that's the latest color that they make that one I think that was like three dollars or something and then moving on to I got the new cover effects mattifying setting spray which I've tried it like two times I'm not sure if I like it more than the de slick spray from urban decay but I really do like this and I also got the cover effects um, the mini size of the illuminating spray because I don't really do illuminating skin a whole lot. I also got the new NARS bronzers, which it is called the Sun Wash Diffusing Bronzer. Okay. And I got it in the shade Casino. And then the next, I just got another pair of these lashes from Velour. These are my favorite lashes ever. And it is Mama Knows Best. I've, this is my third pair of these, I think. And these are $25 from Velour. And I got both of these from Stila. And these are like the best fucking glitters ever in the entire world. This one is in Gold Goddess. This one is Diamond Dust. Also, I bought this stupid ass fucking foundation brush um, from Amazon just because Manny made a video of it. It was like $10. Um, but I got this just because. And then we will move on to my Morphe bag. It's like a huge ass bag for nothing. But I, what, they had a Morphe stand at DragCon that I was at five brushes and they gave me a free brush. They're dirty because I just used them today when I got ready. So the first one I got the gel liner just because you can't have enough eyeliner. This was only $5. Good job Morphe. I haven't even used this yet and it's been like a month and a half. Um, this brush was free. Like if you get like five brushes, you get a free one. That's how it was. Um, they didn't even scan this one. So I don't know how much it was, but this is the E30 blending brush. And then I got the Morphe R7 brush for bronzer. This was $14. I got the M573. This was $5, which is awesome. I got the M502, which is $5. It's the M562, which is like a really tiny precision brush, um, just for like adding a little bit of darkness, like right on the outer corner. This was $3. And the M M573, which is $5. I don't know if I already read that or not. I don't know. But um, I got five brushes and then the free one. So the total was only $37 for all of this, which is really good. All right, so on to the next thing that I bought. This is from the Jeffree Star booth that was at DragCon. So everyone knows that I got this because I made a whole video on the stuff from the Manny and Jeffree collab. So obviously I have the I'm Shook lipstick, Daddy, and Eclipse, which if you want to see me like do a tutorial on that, that is like four videos ago, I think. And um, you should watch that. And then at DragCon, they had everything on sale. I got four liquid lipsticks. I got Scorpio, which is like a purple kind of color. I got Leo, which is a darker nude. I got Mannequin, which is like my favorite shit ever. You guys know I like nudes like this. Um, and then I also got Breakfast at Tiffany's, 
which is so not me, but I got it anyway. And then I also got um, Siberian Gold, the skin frost, because I was trying to get this so bad when it released, and then it was sold out, and I never really got around to getting it again. But it's a really pretty gold color. And now we are moving on to the free ship from Sephora, which is this full bag. So as you know, I am an employee at Sephora. So we do get free stuff almost every week or like every other week we get stuff and they call it gratis, which is just like stuff that the brands give you when you train with them. And then the next thing I have the Radiance Activator from Estee Edit. I like using this under my foundation because it's like super, super radiant. And then the next thing is the Josie Marin Argan Liquid Gold Self Tanning Oil. This is so fucking pretty, but the oil in it kind of like started like giving me like a, a, a rash or like a breakout or something on my body but it's so pretty I wish I I'm probably still gonna use it honestly I'm probably just gonna get over it. and then the brand away which is a hair care brand that we sell at my store it is like a dry shampoo foam and this is awesome because I'm lazy and also my hair color I can't wash my hair every day this is awesome like because there's no water in this at all if you do like straighten or curl your hair and you don't want to do like a foam because it will like ruin the style of your hair there's no water in this so it's not wetting your hair ruining the style of your hair. the milk blur stick which i have on now i love this shit so much and this is like something i wear even when i don't wear makeup because it's awesome as your primer i don't put it all over my whole face i just do it right on my nose right on the tops of my cheek and like the center of the forehead and it's awesome this also from ola hendrickson is the truth serum and this is like vitamin c and collagen boosting shit like that so I really do like the vitamin C in it and it smells kind of like orangey next thing is from bare minerals It's the original loose powder I have this already but this is in a different color um, it's in the shade medium beige and 20 so it's just like a loose powder foundation I like this for like these where I'm not really wearing any foundation but I just do a little bit of this just to cover my shit. All right, and the next thing is the Urban Decay D Slick Spray. This is my favorite setting spray ever. I've probably bought like seven of these, and I'm this is the first time I've ever gotten one for free. So I'm super, super excited that we got that. All right, and then I got this all-in-one cleanser and toner from Dr. Dennis Gross, and also from Ola Hendrickson. I got a lot of Ola Hendrickson this time. I got the Pore Balance Facial Scrub. So this is really good if you have more oily skin or like oily combo, which is kind of me. Um, I have the Moisture Surge from Clinique. This is brand new. I don't know if this is out or it just came out. Um, it is the Hydrating Supercharged Concentrate. So you can use this as your serum, your moisturizer. Like, I'm pretty sure you can use it for literally anything. So this is from Sephora Collection, which I'm really happy. I never really get a whole lot of Sephora Collection stuff in gratis, but um, this is the Micellar Cleansing Milk and it is the coconut milk one. I really like using this. And also from Clinique, I have the Pepstar Hydro Blur Moisturizer. This would be perfect for daytime too because of the blurring effect in it. And also Sephora gave me one of these brushes, which is the number 95 brush. So it is the, the Pro Diffuser Angled Brush. So I haven't opened it yet, obviously, but it is the 95 brush and then urban decay also gave me one of their liquid lipsticks i would probably never wear this on me I'm happy that i have a pink for other people it's really pretty it's like a shimmery metallic pink so it's really pretty just not i wouldn't wear pink on me i got the mark jacobs um lip gloss in the shade sugar sugar this is my favorite lips lip gloss ever and it has just a right amount of shimmer in it and it's like it's like so nude you can barely see it on me i love this so much the Giorgio Armani Power Fabric, and I'm so excited that they got my shade right it's in the shade 5. But this one, you have to really be careful. If you know that you're like a 5 in the Luminous Silk, get the 4 in this because it oxidizes so much. And also from Bare Minerals, they gave me one of um, the Bare Pro powders. And right when I started my YouTube, like a couple, like a year ago, I think, um, I did talk about these because I got every single color. So like my whole powder drawer, I have rows of these because they like let us pick what color we wanted when I got hired at Sephora and I picked all of them. So I got all of them, but I'm really happy I have the one in 10 because that's the one I use on myself. So I'm glad I have a backup one of that one. And we have the Tristique. Um, this is the mattifying uh, blurring balm. So I guess it's kind of similar to the blur stick. So I might have to do like half my face with this, half the face with blur stick and see if I notice a difference. This is more mattifying than blurring. Um, but it, 
you can't see shit. It's invisible. But um, this is awesome. I would use this like all on my T-zone. And I like the stick applicator. I have another thing in there. This is the little mini highlighting stick, which this is so pretty. It's, oh, there you go. It's really pretty. From Buxom, I have this lip gloss. It, wait, I think it's the liquid lips. Yeah, this is a liquid lipstick. And it is in the shade White Russian, which is a really, really pink nude, which is right there. So it's really good nude for me. And then I got another Better Than Sex Mascara. So that's a good backup to have. Nikkei gave me one of their blushes in the shade Obsessed. So it's a super pretty pink blush, which is good because I really don't have that many blushes. And then Tarte gave me one of their highlighters in the shade Stunner, which is really pretty. Kat Von D sent us these things, um, two little liners. They're lip liners from her new lip liner collection. This is OG Lolita, which looks like that. It's really really pretty um, color if you wear a lot of like pink nudes and then this one I don't know if I'll ever really use this because it's like you can't even see it on me it's literally like the color of my skin um, it's like super super nude this is the shade Swanly 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 and Glamgo gave me three of the lip lip glosses they are the plump rageous lip gloss treatment and they are also plumping, and the applicator is so cool. It's like very, very different. And I have the new Dior mascara. This is the plump, what the hell is it called? Plump and volume mascara from Dior, and it's like you squeeze it. It's kind of a weird thing to do, but like you squeeze it when you pull it out, and it like puts just the right amount on there. And I really do like the Dior mascaras, they're so pretty. All right, and then Hourglass gave me one of their liquid liners. This is this has replaced my like tattoo liner from Cavani, my ink liner, my Stila liner. This is like after this is gone, I'm buying another one. Like I love this. That is the last thing from my haul. So I've been recording for 40 minutes now. So hopefully I can edit this down into 15 minutes. Thank you so much for watching, and if you enjoyed watching this shit. Um, please give it a thumbs up and also if you have any suggestions for a video my Instagram's written right here again Just DM me. I'll reply back and we can talk about stuff. All right. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye